As waistlines are getting thicker and thicker, we are constantly looking for quick fixes to battle the bulge. You see these fad diets everywhere on social media, from Facebook posts to magazine articles to celebrities' Instagram pages. But are these diets causing you more harm than good? In this video, we will be explaining four popular fad diets, the juice cleanse, the Atkins diet, intermittent fasting, and eating vegan. We will explore the claims of these diets and determine what is going on in your body so you are able to make informed decisions regarding your health. Juice cleanses have typically been marketed towards individuals looking to detox their body and lose weight. The diet is restricted to drinking juices up to 8 times a day and often lasts for up to 3 days. Impressive claims such as saturating the body with nutrients and antioxidants as well as sustained weight loss has added to their popularity. It is true that fruit and vegetable based juices contain many vitamins and minerals, but did you know that your body detoxifies itself naturally and consuming calories from a liquid diet has no impact on this process? These drinks are also extremely high in sugar, with some containing up to two times the daily recommended sugar intake. Increased sugar has been linked to weight gain and puts you at higher risk for diseases like diabetes and coronary heart disease. Juice cleanses often provide less than 1,000 calories a day, and while this caloric deficit does lead to temporary weight loss, the weight loss won't be sustained over long periods of time. Low calorie diets are associated with high levels of cortisol, which is linked with stress and prevents weight loss. These diets are often lacking in protein and fat, which are important for normal bodily functions like maintaining muscle mass and insulation. The next diet we will talk about is veganism. Although typically associated with ethical or environmental concerns, veganism has recently surged in popularity as a way to shed extra pounds. Consuming a vegan diet means avoiding meat and other animal byproducts including eggs, milk, and cheese. One of the major sources of concern for eating a vegan diet is obtaining an appropriate amount of protein. Insufficient protein leads to decreased muscle mass and functionality. Many protein alternatives like vegan meat or cheeses can be high in sodium, calories, and fat and should not be considered a long-term sustainable protein replacement. Weight loss is associated with eating vegan if careful consideration is taken to ensure that they don't compensate with high calorie carbohydrates and fats. Some individuals report feeling lethargic when switching to veganism due to a vitamin B12 deficiency, a vitamin that can only be obtained through animal byproducts. However, taking a vitamin will resolve tiredness. Intermittent fasting has become very popular and it involves cycling between a fasting stage and a non-fasting stage. The most popular intermittent fasting schedule involves fasting for 16 hours and then only consuming food within an 8 hour window. However, the schedule can vary between individuals. This diet claims that it is effective for losing weight and improves overall health including improving one's metabolism and delaying onset of diseases. Fasting has been shown to reduce risk of heart disease as it decreases heart rate and blood pressure. During fasting periods, ketones are released into the bloodstream which have been shown to help memory and learning as well as delaying disease progression in the brain. Intermittent fasting has been linked to weight loss due to the body's use of fat instead of carbohydrates as its main energy source during the fasting period. However, this diet may encourage extreme behavior like binge eating, which can result in an increased amount of calories being consumed during the non-fasting period. This would counteract the effects of intermittent fasting and result in fat accumulation. The final diet we will talk about is the Atkins 20 diet. This diet has been around for a long time and claims that you will not only lose weight without exercising, but will also never feel hungry on the diet. This diet involves consuming meals that are low in carbohydrates and high in protein. Studies have been shown that even with exercise, weight loss was only achieved short term. Once carbohydrates were reintroduced back into the diet, there was a high likelihood that they would gain back the weight they initially lost. Diets high in protein have been linked with increased satiety, reducing the amount of food eaten in a day. Evidence suggests that diets high in protein result in decreased weight and fat loss. However, even with the inclusion of high protein foods, if you ever stop dieting, you will gain the weight back. 
Research has found that instead of focusing on the low carbohydrate aspect of the Atkins 20 diet, a balanced diet with high protein would be much more effective. Seeing all these diets on social media can be confusing and overwhelming as they are all claiming to do wonders for your body. It is important to stay informed and we hope this video allowed you to improve your understanding on these diets. Make sure you consult with a physician before starting a new diet to make sure it's the right fit for you. Please subscribe to the Demystifying channel video below for more videos like this one.